What if viruses hold the key to the future medicine? What if porous small lava stone we can find at the Jeju Island can teach us how to design future medicine? I'm going to talk about two very important medical amenities and how we try to solve these biomedical challenges by learning from this tiny virus and porous lava stone. One medical amenity is about targeted delivery. If we can selectively deliver drugs to the target site, such as a cancer tissue or a target organ, then we could dramatically increase the therapeutic efficacy with less amount of drug with less adverse effects. And another medical amenity is about intracellular delivery. So certain drug candidates, such as small RNAs, fail to become commercial drugs because they cannot go into cells and they are degraded by enzymes in vivo. Therefore, we need some kind of protective delivery carrier is needed for uh, intracellular delivery of this kind of drugs. So how can you make the biotherapeutics go into cells? The answer is in the nature. We can mimic virus infection. Viruses go into cells to survive, and scientists revealed that viruses go into human cells by a mechanism called endocytosis. So in my lab, we mimic this virus and we engineered virus, uh, uh, virus particle mimicking small nanoparticle. The name is degradable. So our particle degradable is very similar to virus in terms of its intracellular delivery mechanism. And also, in addition, they can sustainably release drugs inside cells. The degradable, we engineered this particle to have numerous pores inside to accommodate many copies of therapeutics inside, just like this porous lava stone. And also, it can maintain the structural robustness just like porous lava stone. And also, we can control all the physical and chemical properties of this degradable. For example, for the loading of negatively charged RNAs, we can chemically modify inner surface of this degradable to load these negatively charged drugs inside pores by electrostatic interaction. To be successful as a gene delivery carrier, degradable should go into cells. In fact, we found that degradable is readily uptaken by human cells, and after its mission of drug delivery, they just disappear from the body because we used biodegradable materials to build up this tiny porous nanostructure. We first designed our degradable for the siRNA delivery. siRNA is a short interfering RNA which can inhibit the target gene expression. We designed the sequence of the siRNA to inhibit the protein expression which is responsible for fast tumor growth. We found that our degradable could greatly block the growth of tumors. Our degradable is also very effective for the therapeutic DNA delivery. So in fact, uh, traditionally, people use viruses, real virus, for the gene delivery. But that kind of approach raised many concerns on safety. Now we can use our degradable for safe and effective therapeutic DNA delivery in vivo. We next tested our degradable for wound healing model. Here, we tested that our DNA plus degradable for the wound healing, and we found that our complex induced very fast wound healing. This approach can be applied for other vascular diseases also. Our next challenge is in the field of immuno-oncology. So we found that our degradable can induce higher therapeutic efficacy with less amount of antibodies in this uh, tumor model. Our degradable is also compatible with intra-arterial delivery of cancer drugs through this microcatheter, which is uh, inserted through artery. We can combine many different kinds of drugs with our degradable and then put them through this microcatheter for better tumor targeting. So by this way, we can generate many different types of drugs. Our degradable is very broad platform technology, which enables many drug modalities. I expect that this degradable technology could be a powerful solution for the future biotherapeutics development, especially for cancer therapy. So far, I talked about how we designed and developed degradable inspired by virus and small porous lava stone. We expect that this degradable will be a very good key platform technology to solve medical amenities by enhancing 
drug efficacy with less adverse effects for the diverse range of future drugs, especially for RNA, DNA, biotherapeutics. Thank you.